So 87% of Australians engaged uh, with government through digital channels and satisfaction was, was at about 60% uh, with, with, the, with the engagement with government through digital. Uh, more than 50% of Australians are comfortable engaging with government through digital channels. So certainly the use of digital in government, in the delivery of government services is a, is a huge area of, of value, not just because it can cut cost, uh, more importantly, because it's about delivering the right services to the right person in the right location. The other area that's really critical, however, when we think about digital and government, is the application of digital capability to inform policy design. So 46% of, of Australian uh, citizens uh, have told us that they're comfortable sharing uh, data with government if it means that government operates more seamlessly, uh, that they don't have to, to, you know, basically update different government departments with exactly the same information. And, and that's something that we see, it's a trend that we see globally. Citizens want an easier to deal with government. They want it to be easier to consume government services. And, and you know, from a government perspective, government wants to reduce burden, unintended burden on the economy, because there's a lot of economic value that can be released if we make these interactions seamless, easier for citizens. So 90% of the digital opinion leaders that we surveyed believe there is a role for government to promote, to, to support funding, to really challenge the status quo, the way current Australian businesses run. Uh, I would say that the most critical role for government is, is to be a trendsetter in its own right, to lead by example. Uh, it's, it's in the way it delivers its own services, in the way that it applies digital insights to optimising policy decisions.